guys, it's Joanna back with another video. This is the third and final of my mystery box cooking um, videos for right now. And I am going to be making up the one I picked items and I had to figure out from. So it's not exactly a mystery box, but stick with me on this. Okay. Okay, so my five ingredients for mine were a brat or sausage and I'm going to use the maple brown sugar apple maple brown sugar one like I used in one of the other videos some Hawaiian bread some eggs some green onion and some strawberries so what I'm thinking I'm going to make is a French toast casserole or no I'm going to do French toast on the stove and I'm going to top it with strawberries and then I'm going to make an egg scramble to go on the side and do that with um, cheese and um, green onions on it. So that's my thoughts but let's see what I can come up with with this. So what I am going to do is I think french toast and an egg scramble or maybe french toast egg sandwiches. Uh, oh sorry guys I'm talking to you and you're not even seeing me. Okay, so I'm trying to figure out how I want to do this. So I have milk in the fridge. I know that the um, French toast could be made with the um, eggs and the green or the strawberries. That could be one dish and then it would be just the sausage on the side, the brat on the side. Or I can choose to put the brat in with some more eggs and make another dish. Um, I'm trying to decide what I really feel like doing with that. Make French toast this morning with the Hawaiian bread. So we know we're doing French toast with strawberries on top. It's so I think we'll do. I think I'm going to do the sausage casserole, the, or the sausage and egg bake to go with it. And so I've got my butter, and then I'm going to add some cheese into this mix. So those are the extra two ingredients that I'm adding. And I'm going to use my griddle for the French toast and my skillet for my eggs. I'm going to first. Okay, so I'm going to mix up some batter for the French toast. So I'm going to be using about four eggs for breakfast. So that's about two eggs a piece. Okay, so I'm going to take a knife and I'm going to cut open my brat as I did in the other two meals I made with brats. I'm going to go ahead and get this going. The skillet for the brat. And this brat is really delicious smelling when it's cooking and it is also very tasty when you eat it. I'll take that this way. Thank you. So we're going to put in two eggs in here. Okay. And then I'll pack two more eggs into that. I'm going to put just a dash of honey in my um, French toast this morning. So I think about half a teaspoon of honey. And a splash of vanilla. So we're making up our French toast. I've never tried doing it with some honey in it. We're going to have a little fun. Hey, that's what cooking's about. Having a little fun and making meals that taste good. So we're going to put in a little bit more. There we go. We put a splash of that. Now we're going to do a sprinkle of cinnamon. Cinnamon. Now the next step thing is I gotta get my milk. I gotta put some milk in my French toast mix. That looks about right. And I'll whisk this up. The Hawaiian sweetened bread that I will be working with here in a minute. As soon as I get this. Oh, I see some apple pieces in this brought this time. Okay, I'm going to turn off this skillet for the moment because I need to get a couple things ready. Okay, guys, we're going to go over and crack two eggs into this bowl to go in with that, but I'm not going to put that in until I've got my French toast almost cooked. Then I'll finish up the eggs, the egg uh, breakfast. Then we'll plate it all, putting in um, cheese and green onion on that and doing strawberries on the tops of the um, French toast. So that'll be breakfast. 
Because of how sensitive my stomach is, I'm going to make French toast with plain bread instead. Just because I don't want to be getting sick off my breakfast and not enjoying my day. Um, so we have a substitution, but that's okay. It's still got me going, so I'm going to take a saucer and put my bread on that. I think four pieces of bread should do us for this recipe. Okay, let's put a little oil on my skillet and my griddle. And then we're going to take and put the bread and get both sides coated. We got the sausage ready over here. We just have to add the eggs over here. see how this turns out for the flavors I picked for the uh, French toast, especially. Oops. Okay. Oh, you guys can't see what's going on over there. Come on back over here and join me. Okay, now I'm going to turn the other skillet back on. And now that we got that going, we're going to take and put in the scramble, scramble up some eggs in with this sausage. Same ba th basic thing I did in the other one. But what I'm doing this time is different, is I'm pairing it with French toast. how I plate it might be different too. I am a scrambled egg girl. I don't like like omelets and that as much as I do scrambled eggs. So that's why I'm scram doing scramble. I'll eat hard boiled too. But don't eat them like plain. I eat them like in deviled eggs and egg salad sandwiches. And that's about the only way I eat eggs. Is egg salad sandwiches, deviled eggs, and scrambled eggs. Like in other foods like cookies and breakfast foods like pancakes or something like that, but I won't eat eggs plain by themselves in any other format that I can think of. I do omelets every once in a great while, but I have to really be in the mood for an omelet to eat an omelet. Yeah. So before, what I'm going to do is go back over to the skillet that has the sausage and eggs, and I'm going to throw a little cheese on now that I've turned it off, just so that the cheese can kind of melt on it. Just Cutting up my strawberries and putting them on my French toast, making French toast stacks after I put a little sugar on each one. And then um, and then I'm going to put the scrambled eggs and sausage beside it, and I'm gonna top that with some green onion. I've already put the cheese on it, so. Okay, now we'll put let's put a sprinkle of sugar on that. Okay, now we'll do the next layer. Now, let's set this there for a second. And we're going to divide this skillet in half. So that looks good for Mom. And this looks good for me.
Now, well, here's the French toast and egg uh, scramble that I made up. So you tried the scramble first. Oh, is it? I'm gonna try your. Good. Mm -hmm. The sausage um, mixture is really good. Now I'm going to try my French toast. Okay. So not bad breakfast. It's pretty good. Um, Come up to the table chair. Comment down below five ingredients you'd like to see me use in our recipes or in multiple recipes. Um, and I'll try it take the challenge on with what you guys send me for suggestions. Also, um, if you try doing this yourself, get somebody else to pick five ingredients for you and then try this yourself or take the five ingredients I use. Guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to click subscribe if you haven't already. Comment, like I said, comment down below what you think I should do next for ingredients. And, um, Click the notification bell so you don't miss out on when these videos go up. And I hope you all have a wonderful day filled with lots of love and laughter. And we'll catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.